Hello everyone, how are you? Happy Monday! What a momentous day. Um, not going to talk about COVID or the vaccine, but just um, pretty amazing that I'm hoping this is the start of getting back to normal. Now, that is not why I came on here today. Uh, for those of you that don't know me, my name is Dana or Dana, or D, you can call me whatever you want. Um, I'm the creator of this group, and I'm also a board-certified holistic health practitioner and the founder of the ADHD Thrive Method for Kids. And I work with families impacted by ADHD to really help them fight symptoms with food and a natural approach. And I wanted to pop on here today to talk with you about your goals. Now, it seems pretty fitting to be talking about this now as we're coming towards the end of the new year. Um, but I remember years ago, my only goal was to get through the day. My son's behavior was so difficult. That was the best I could do. I, I literally didn't have the mental energy to think about big goals for me or for my family or for the future. Um, the only aim was to make it through the next minute, the next hour, the next day. And I was basically living each day just waiting for bedtime. Can any of you relate to this? If you can, leave me a comment below because not only will it make me realize, which I, I know now that I'm not alone, but by sharing this with others, it makes them realize that they're not alone too. And I speak to families day in and day out. And you know, when I acknowledge the pain that they're going through and tell them that, that I went through exactly the same thing, a lot of the time I hear this sigh of relief because it's the first time that they've heard that they're not the only one, that they're not the only one going through this pain. And the problem with living like the, like I was living is that I wasn't happy. No one in my family was. Uh, we were all just surviving, but none of us were actually thriving. Uh, as we began to make progress with my son and as I learned more and more about how nutrition affects behavior, I finally started to set new goals for my family. My focus wasn't only fixed on surviving that day, but became more targeted. I began working towards something. You know, at first, the goal was simply to get rid of gluten, okay? Once we, I can see that Cheryl's saying absolutely. Thanks for sharing, Cheryl. Um, so my first goal was to get rid of gluten. Then it was to get rid of dairy, then soy. Then as my son's behavior began to improve, my goals for him and for our family grew. We hit roadblocks, as I'm sure all families do. The journey on this is not straight. It is like this. There were financial setbacks that we had to work through, and it was it it was definitely hard at times. And I don't want to paint you know a completely pretty pretty picture, but each day we made more and more progress towards the goals we set. Now, I don't just dream of making it through the day anymore. My dreams are so much bigger now because I know we can actually reach them, and I want that for you too. I don't want you to live each day aiming only for survival. I want you aiming for so much more. And I'd love to hear from you in the comments if you didn't have any behavior issues with your children, if all the issues you were facing disappeared, what is one dream you would love to see happen? Let me know in the comments below. You know, one of the first dreams I had for, for my family, you know, after we, we got through this was once we started seeing behavior improvements was to eat out at a restaurant as a family without any issues, without any electronic devices and have a normal conversation. And I know that might seem small to some people, but at one time, that was actually a massive goal for us. Now, I can tell you between you and me, we eat out all the time without issues on a regular basis. Obviously, not when COVID's around, and I'm hoping that that can one day uh, resume. And I truly believe that the ADHD Thrive Method for Kids can help you 
reach your goals too. Now, in case you're unfamiliar with the ADHD Thrive Method for Kids, I wanted to share a brief summary um, of what the program offers because I know there's a lot of new people in here and I don't talk about it often. I'm just, I give uh, a lot of, um, I come on here and talk about a lot of different things but I don't talk about the program very often. Um, it's my 12 week program that teaches you exactly what you need to know to fight your child's ADHD symptoms with food and a natural approach. And in the process, heal your child's body, brain and gut and improve their behavior and reduce their ADHD symptoms as a result. And when you break it down, it's just four things. Number one is a step-by-step -step plan. Number two is all the tools you need. Number three is that expert guidance and number four is the support. And I walk with you each step of the way and help you throughout the entire process. Now, I understand that you might be afraid that this program won't work for you. It's totally okay to feel that way because this is a whole new way of looking at behavior, looking at ADHD symptoms and looking at food. But I just wanna pose something to you for a second. Just imagine that this program does actually help you reduce your child's symptoms, improve your family life, and provide you and your child with lifelong foundations that will help you build a stronger future for them and for your family. Let's just imagine that this program does help you move from a place of surviving each day to actually thriving. Is it worth a try to you? Now, I've opened up some time in my schedule over the next few weeks and my team schedule to talk with you about how the ADHD Thrive Method for Kids can help you and your family. And I'm gonna add a link in the comments below for you to use to book your free call with us so we can chat about the program. But not only just chat about the program, chat about how we can get you from surviving to thriving. If that's something you're interested in, just click the link below when I put it in the comments and you can schedule a time that works for you. Guys, I hope that this was beneficial to you today. I hope you enjoyed my, oh, wrong side, hold on. <laughs> Back to front when, when I'm on Facebook Live. My little Christmas tree and my uh, reward chart in the back here um, uh, of, of this Facebook Live. Guys, have a great evening. I hope that you're all well and I look forward to chatting soon. Take care.